We interrupt this program to bring you a breaking news report. The previously dormant supervolcano, located in Yellowstone National Park, is currently beginning the first stages of its eruption. This was caused by a subsurface tremor caused by tectonic plate activity between the Pacific and North American continental plates. This will result in large-scale fallout across the continent, with all states within the USA being affected in some way or another. Federal authorities have already begun immediate evacuations of all possible tourists within the National Park after one pair of hikers called the Bureau of Seismology with reports of large quakes and rumblings in the immediate vicinity surrounding Yellowstone. The current predicted area of effect of the explosion is presumed to cover the entirety of the continental US and also a large portion of Canada. The eight surrounding states would be the heaviest hit, getting covered with approximately 300 millimeters of ash. The authorities have called for statewide evacuations of Wyoming and all surrounding states, so please remain calm and follow your local emergency workers' directions to evacuate in the quickest and safest manner possible. We're crossing now live to our eye in the sky. The most recent stream of seismic activity around the Yellowstone area has pulled all of the edges of the volcanic crater, or caldera, further apart resulting in an escape route for the large chamber of lava and gas beneath to escape from. As a pressure difference exists between the rising mag magma from the Earth's mantle and the surface, the magma rushes out to equalize the pressure chains, resulting in the volcanic eruption. However, due to a large time gap since the supervolcano's last eruption, which occurred approximately 630,000 years ago, an excessive buildup of ash and debris will also spew out, covering most of the US in an ash cloud. This will result in catastrophic damages to all agricultural areas, as their soils and fields will be covered in volcanic soot, preventing growth until its removal. Some people are calling for the heads of the members of the Yellowstone Volcanic Observatory, who recently claimed that Yellowstone would not be erupting anytime soon even though they detected significant rises in the floor of the magma chamber over the last several years, which is often considered by most geologists as a sure sign that a volcano is getting ready to begin an eruption cycle. When asked what he would do about the current crisis, current presidency frontrunner Donald Trump said, we should build a wall around the national park. That'll stop the problem. Once again, a reminder to all people within Wyoming and the states surrounding the volcano, please follow the directions of your local emergency workers to ensure a safe and efficient evacuation from the area. We will continue to keep you all updated on this fire in the hole. Good luck to you all and God bless. And now back to your scheduled programming of The Bachelorette.